what is going on people welcome back to another video on aj5 so in today's video it's all about polymath guys this crypto has been gaining serious values over the last 24 hours and over the past few days as well so that's what we're going to be going into today looking at its potential over the next few days weeks and months and seeing what price target it can hit by the end of the year and a lot of, a lot of people have been asking me is it crypto worth investing into is it too late should you wait for a dip so on and so on so these are some of the questions which i'm also going to be answering so as you can see it has gone up 21% in the last 24 hours making it 81 cents per coin and even though the market has been down quite a bit today 8% down it has taken uh, quite of a hard hit today you would have seen your portfolio go down today so have i but uh, polymath has you know managed to stay up and 20% up is quite good as well so any further questions which you guys may have let me know in the comment section down below and i'll be answering them in my next polymath update so before i get into all of that i just want to let you guys know this is no financial advice i'm not a financial advisor anything i say is from my own prediction and my take on this crypto and any gains or losses you guys make i will not be responsible for and also if you're new to the channel make sure to go down and smash that subscribe button as well as like the video as i'm trying to hit 35k subs as soon as possible so if you guys help me hit that by the end of the month i will be doing a giveaway and all you guys need to do to enter the giveaway way is simply subscribe to the channel and for a bonus entry follow me on instagram link to that will be in the description box down below so 20 percent up in the last day over the week 17 percent up we can see it has slightly dipped in value for the first quarter first half of the month and then uh, went back up in value here on november the 15th hitting 95 cents and then yeah it's been gone up and down up and down recently and over the month 13 percent up scrolling down here we can see that the market cap at the moment is 605.2 million dollars the volume in the last 24 hours 629.7 million dollars and we've got the circulating supply of 761.7 million poly so trading activity as usual we've got way more people investing into the crypto rather than selling it and we've got a small very small percentage of people selling the crypto you know taking their profits out maybe to uh, you know reinvest into this crypto or reinvest into a different crypto or take out the profits to enjoy life you know so scrolling down we can see that the polymass is on the rise this week and it is 51 percent below its all-time high of one dollar and 66 cents which was hit let's have a look so it was quite a while ago i'm guessing yes it was all the way back in 2018 so february let's get the exact date so february the 19th 2018 was when it hit its all-time high so what i want you guys to do is comment down below if you guys are predicting polymath to get to hit a new all-time high by the end of the year bearing in mind we just got about six weeks left for the end of the year so let me know if you guys believe polymath can hit a new all-time high and if so what price target can it hit the dollar mark two dollars three dollars let me know in the comment section down below so going into the coin market cap website we can also see here that the trading volume has gone up by huge three thousand five hundred percent in the last 24 hours so we've got way more people investing into the crypto and also a minority of people selling it as well but the whole point is that there are a lot of people a huge amount of people investing into this crypto right now over the last 24 hours yes there has been a lot of hype around polymath and the way it's going up in value and yeah it just makes the people want to invest into the crypto and uh you know some people selling it off as well if you guys have been following me on instagram you would have seen me purchasing polymath over the last couple of months and i haven't sold it i'm still holding on to it and if it does dip to a certain price target i will be buying more of it if you guys want to find out when that is all you need to do is follow me on my instagram because every time i buy and sell cryptos i post it on my instagram story to let you guys know what i've bought what i've sold and basically what i'm doing with my cryptos so let's get some indicators out at the bottom here we've got the macd indicator and at the top we've got the candlestick pattern chart so we're going to be using this macd indicator to do some price predictions so uh, i'm going to zoom in into the 30 minute chart so here we have the week's worth of chart goes back about to about last tuesday the 9th and again if you watch my videos you would know that the 30 minute chart only predicts the next few hours but i know you guys are here for the long-term prediction so that is why i will be moving on to the hourly daily and weekly chart later on in the video to look at the longer term prediction over the next few days weeks and months as well so next few hours how is it looking so looking quite positive we've got the blue line and the orange line looking bullish again they're not looking too steep they are looking just about positive so do expect slight increases in value over the next couple of hours however this does not mean that it's going to be consistently be going up in value do expect dips as well as peaks but the overall outcome over the next few hours so towards the end of the day looks more on the positive side so do expect some more increases in value for polymath today moving on to the hourly chart 
next few days how is it looking so looking not too bad or not too good so we've got the orange line looking a little bit bullish and so is the blue line so they're slightly going towards the bullish direction but this means that do expect dips for polymath over the coming days guys um, dips are on the way but the overall outcome over the next probably towards the end of the week seems to be positive but as as i mentioned earlier dips are always part of the process do expect dips just like what's happening here right now to the whole crypto market literally most of the cryptos are down including bitcoin ethereum so on and so on you know uh, look at ethereum 10 percent down that is a huge amount and yeah so that's how it works guys but the overall outcome is positive so that's all that matters for those of you who are into it for the long term moving on to the daily chart next few weeks what can we expect still looking positive the blue line is looking quite steep as well and the orange line is looking bullish so at the end of the day both of them are looking positive and they're both uh, look it looks like over the long run next four to five weeks um, so hopefully by mid december to late december we should expect a price increase hopefully hitting just about the dollar mark by the end of the year but it could be much higher than that depending on how the crypto market performs but yeah these are my predictions and my takes on this crypto guys i am hoping this crypto can hit a new all-time high obviously we can see uh when was this was a while ago wasn't it so let's look at the weekly chart so it hit the one dollar and 66 cents so it's halfway there at the moment so it has to go through just about a hundred percent increase but the way it's going at the moment looks like it may be able to hit a new all-time high or very close to it so at the moment i'm going to stick it as a yes it can hit a new all-time high but again this may change according to how the whole crypto market performs and that is why i'm going to keep you guys updated on a regular basis on this crypto if you guys have any preferences let me know in the comment section down below is it once a week twice a week three times a week or whatever it may be let me know in the comment section down below but yeah guys that, these are my predictions don't forget to comment down your end of year prediction for polymath and yeah uh, for me i'm not hold, i'm not uh, sorry I'm, i am holding on to it but i'm not purchasing any at the moment because of the value for me anyway it is a bit high but that doesn't mean that you shouldn't invest into it if you're in it for the long term guys you know it's always going to be its value that is at the moment anytime during the next year two years three years uh, you know if you're into it long term I, I mean it's not a bad time to invest into it but it all depends on you and if you're a short-term trader for, i'm not a short-term trader when it comes to crypto i'm in it for the long term so i wouldn't really know about the short term but with all these fees and so on for me anyway is not worth it but uh yeah there are a lot of people making good money from short trading uh, polymath but again it is a risky one as well when it comes to short term but yeah anyways that is pretty much it for today's video if you guys have any further questions on this crypto let me know in the comment section down below and i'll be answering them in my next update and also let's try and hit 100 likes on this video so go down and smash the like button and let's try and hit 35k subs as soon as possible so make sure to go down and smash that subscribe button as well but yeah i'm not going to keep you guys here for any longer i just want to say a huge thank you to every single one of you who have been subscribing liking commenting and just supporting the channel in any way or form a huge shout out and a huge thank you to you guys and appreciate each and every single one of you keep supporting and i'll keep giving back and that is the motive on this channel but yeah i'll catch all of you guys on my next crypto update video which should be later on today trying to stay consistent guys for you guys so yeah make sure to subscribe like share comment you know the drill and i'll catch all of you guys on my next crypto update take care and peace